Is the new Spanish gold coin worth buying? How you doing everybody? Welcome to Empire Precious Metals. Thanks so much for tuning in. If you're new to the channel, make sure you blast that subscribe button and get the bell notification clicked. That way you get updated with any new content. I got a large shipment in today of tons of silver and gold. I would say I would estimate it at least around fifteen, twenty thousand dollars $20,000 worth. Um, I will be doing, I guess, an unboxing video uh, just after I finish this, but I wanted to get the word out on these coins before it's too late for some of you who are possibly sleeping on these, okay? And it is the Spanish gold coins, the Spanish doubloons, okay? This is the buffalo tube, so we can move that over there. This is my collectible. Here you go. Here's my collectible. I call it my collectible gold. Um, if you you guys are looking to stack gold and if you're looking to stack cheap gold and if you're looking to stack cheap gold that is going to appreciate in value you need to be buying these coins um i've been selling the 10th ounce coins on my auction 7 p.m eastern shameless plug 7 p.m eastern and uh on tuesdays and i've been selling these I've been doing a lot of the 10th ounces because the price point on the 10th ounces are a lot more affordable for people than the one ounce coins. But uh, sometimes every once in a while, I will place an order for some of my customers that are looking for the one ounce coins. Now, the first in the series, before I get into the most recent coin, which is in here, which you're going to want to pick up. First in the series is the Lynx coin. I'm going to show you just how much the prices on these coins have appreciated in just a few moments. We're going to hop over to the computer, but uh, these coins released, um, I would say just uh, for my cost and a lot of the retailers, maybe around anywhere between 12 to 15% over spot. And um, these now are going for, well, I'm not going to give it away. You will see in just a few minutes. But the point is, this coin, you could still pick it up, and it's the first in the series. And when these coins release, they are going for less than what your uh, normal American Gold Eagle, your Gold Buffaloes, your Maple Leafs, your Britannias. These are going for less, considerably less. Now, the first in the series being the Lynx, has a lot of allure to it because this is the first pure gold Spanish coin ever minted. And uh, four nines fine, right? Is that four nines one? Is that four or five? One, two, three. Okay, four nines fine. And the one thing though about this coin, which is interesting, is that these did not have the security features that the newer ones do. When I say newer ones, I'm talking about the bull. Again, this coin, very inexpensive when it first released. And uh, now it has appreciated for uh, quite a bit more. I would say at least $400 more than what they were initially released. Now, the security feature was added on after the first coin was minted. And this lenticular design, you might be able to see it, you might not, changes between a euro, a star, um, I believe the uh, Spanish crown and the pillars. So I think it's like four directions, three or four directions, but very hard to replicate this for counterfeiting purposes. So the bull, you can still pick this up, rather inexpensive. Now, and the 10th ounces too, guys. I mean, the 10th ounces you could still get. I think they minted around 50, 5 0, 50,000 of the 10th ounce coins. And now I am getting the one ounce stallions. Here we go. The moment of truth. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Reverse proof stallion. Just a gorgeous coin. And I got two of them. One is for me, one is going to be sold uh, on the auction or to you know, one of my customers' private deals. Um, but just a really nice coin. Reverse proof, meaning that the matte finish is in the fields in the background and the proof finish is on the devices that are in the foreground. Let's flip this over to check out the obverse. And there you go. Got the security features on there. The same uh, design of the Spanish pillars and the, and the crown. Just a really, really nice coin. Try to get up a little bit closer. All right, do that. 
and we'll flip it back over for you guys in just a moment but just a really really nice looking piece and i was looking at my invoice and i was able to pick this up for drum roll please one thousand nine hundred twenty seven dollars right now spot on gold is right around 1970 i believe give or take but just a really really nice coin and like i said you can get these relatively cheaply compared to any other government minted gold coins you have a bunch of things going for it um now these are the 10th ounces originally i bought these to flip them and sell them on the auction i think what i'm actually going to do is i will probably i'll probably keep the uh maybe i'll sell them i can't decide i always say i want to keep them but to be honest the profit on these is uh too good to pass up and on top of that uh, I'm at the point where it makes more sense for me to buy and stack the one ounce versions as opposed to the 10th ounce versions. Now, in terms of appreciation, why don't we look at how all three of these, well, these two, nothing has been set yet for these coins because they are so new, but we're going to check out just how well these coins are selling for right now. You could still pick them up and uh, not too late for you to get this coin because it is so new. Let's hop over to the computer and then we'll hop back here in just a moment. Okay, so we're gonna see if the new Spanish gold coin is worth buying. And in the meantime, what I wanted to do is quickly pull up some information on the previous two coins that were released, which was the Lynx and the Bull. So looking at the, the Lynx first, that's the first in the series. That one's going to be going for more money than the bull and now the stallion. Uh, if we just look, I just typed in, you know, one ounce gold links coin. We're going to look at a few online uh, searches, online dealers that came up first. So this one being modern coin mart. This is gold buffaloes. All right. So we're going to skip them. Let's look over here. We're just trying to find the, here's the one tenth ounce, 2022 Spanish gold links, Iberian links, one ounce coin. Let's just click that. All right, so silver gold bull, it's probably going to be out of stock. Out of stock. Let's look for another one. Um, Jam Bullion, I'm willing to bet they're going to be out of stock. Atmex will probably have them. All right, so we're looking at 2300 bucks, check or wire. So Atmex has them at $2,300. Uh, if we look on eBay, let's just copy and paste this. This is what I like to do. Copy. Let's go to eBay. You're probably going to see a whole bunch of like collectibles and stuff like that. Um, all right. Spanish gold doubloon. 2500 bucks uh, is being offered on Atmex. That's the other thing you got to make sure that you're doing is when you are shopping online for a gold coin, make sure that you're not only looking at the online retailer site, but also on eBay. Sometimes they have it cheaper on eBay. Sometimes they have it cheaper on their website. Here's an example. So we got 2460 uh, this is the offering price that so we want to do is we want to look at the sold items. All right. So 2,460 bucks on the Iberian links, the reverse proof. Okay. 2,460 and that's raw. Uh, these are the 10th ounces, which range anywhere between, you know, we're seeing anywhere between 230 upwards of like close to 300 bucks. Um, not seeing any others right now. And I don't want to bore you guys looking back too far, but 2460 is the going rate for the gold links. Now let's look at the bull. All right, the bull, you'll probably have an easier chance at finding this one. So let's just look at bull to precious metals right here. Uh, 2170, we're looking at 2170 on the bull. Uh, let's look also here, I don't know bullion by post. I'm only gonna go to the uh, dealers that I know of that are uh, the most reputable. In fact, why don't we, I don't know what that is. Um, why don't we look on Atmex's site directly and type in 2022 Spanish gold bull reverse proof. And let's see what pops up. Do they even have it? It's not looking like they have the bull. Um, let's try another, let's try another search because right now that we're seeing that the, the links are going for 2460. Here's the links. We want the bull um jm bullion okay let's see do they have this jm bullion is probably going to be out of stock currently out of stock you know i got to say jm bullions um 
selection has been a little disappointing. All right, let's look. Silver Gold Bull out of stock. If you guys were able to get these, all right, we're just going to look on eBay and just call it a day. Uh, 2022 Spain Gold Reverse Proof. Let's type in Bull. 2320 bucks. All right, so we're looking at about $100 less on the bull than the links, but still we're looking at $2,300. Now here's the thing, okay? This coin was released. These have cheaper premiums than American Gold Eagles, Britannia's, Maple Leafs. Um, these are almost no brainers when it comes to flipping. Um, just trying to search here. Then they just have all the tenths. So the most recent was the $2,322. So when we look for the stallion now, a lot of places don't have these uh, available. This one here, this is Vegas Coin Dealer. Never heard of them. It's probably some uh, small local coin shop or something. But they've got it for $2,235. Um, let's look on eBay and see if they've got the 2023 Reverse Proof Stallion. No, nothing yet. So I was able to get the one ounce uh, early. The one ounce coins come out first, then they are followed by the 10th ounce coins. Um, the one thing that I do know about the Gold Stallion is that they are said to have a smaller mintage. This site is being flagged for malware. Let's try European Mint. Um, get out of here, pop up. Uh, 2018 euros. Just trying to find the mintage. 12,000 pieces. Okay, so it's the same. I had heard a rumor that there was only going to be like 8,000. So there's 12,000. Same as the other two. Third in the series. I mean, this is a beautiful coin. Uh, let's take a look at it a little bit more on the desk. Hands and coins time. All right, so as you can see, in my opinion, it is a no-brainer when it comes to buying these one-ounce gold coins. You might want to try to pick them up before it's too late. Again, only 12,000 of the one ounce pieces are minted year to year. 50, 50, 50,000 of the 10th ounce bulls and the 10th ounce lynxes. Still, you can pick these up relatively inexpensively and there's plenty of room to uh, appreciate in value. If I had to say, if you were on a budget and you could only do one or the other, then I would say go for the lynx coin because it is the very first Spanish gold coin that is pure gold, pure bullion. I'm actually looking at, I just realized they don't have the security features on the 10th ounce pieces, which makes sense seeing that they are so small. But anyway, do you own these one ounce gold coins? Let me know in the comments down below. And if not, are you going to be buying them?